Welcome back to Daybreak. Hey, look, Mom, I'm on the Jumbotron. This school, East Kentwood High School, has a really awesome program for audiovisual students. In fact, they get professional experience. They broadcast their games. Pepinos will show them. You can watch their broadcast at Pepinos. It's pretty cool. Uh, you have to check that out. So the food drive is a huge component of our Football Frenzy tailgates, and we have collected a record amount of food so far this year. Our community affairs director, Casey Jones, explains how the story is the same in Kentwood. The need is up, but the shelves are somewhat bare. It is a point of pride in Kentwood, cultural diversity, not just in the 83 country flags that hang high at East Kentwood High School, but also on the shelves at the Green Apple. I think the biggest thing is the diversity of the neighbors that we're serving. And we really have the ability to give a lot of very, very nice, fresh food. So our, our selection is, is vast. The food pantry serves more than 750 individuals each month, all the way from Southeast Grand Rapids to Kentwood, Caledonia, and a sliver of Wyoming. And I always say, by the grace of God, go I, because we are all one paycheck away from possibly needing help. And we see that every week. New families come, new individuals come and say, I've never been to a food pantry. I don't know what to do. And that's what we're here for. We feel if a neighbor comes to our front door, they have a need. That's the end of their story. The story of the Green Apple is one that we have heard all season long. The need is up and the donations are down. We were running out of food a week ago. Getting canned goods, shelf-stable food has been difficult. We all see it in the grocery store. You go to a shelf and it's empty, and you think, why is that shelf empty? Well, it's empty here, too. That's why they are ripe and ready for a grand finale frenzy food drive at East Kentwood. I know that some of those kids that are bringing food to us are also some of those families that use our pantry. And so the fact that they are giving back is, is huge. And for every face, behind every flag that waves a hand in need. We pride ourselves in serving our neighbors with, with grace and with respect, and it shows. For News 8, I'm Casey Jones, connecting with community. Yeah, so this is our final food drive, but not really because we're going to continue that effort here um, in other ways, Donovan. Yeah, it's so good to see so many people, like these young people, making a difference uh, at the tailgate. Um, so, yeah, love that, Teresa. Thank you so much.